Hello and welcome to another tutorial. In this tutorial we will continue with the basic Twitter app adding two functions the friends timeline and mentions. First grab a horizontal arrangement and drag it on the component viewer then go to basic and grab a button rename the button BNT friends chirps click OK change the text in the button to friends chirps then grab another button place it next to it rename the button BNT mentions click OK and change the text to mentions then grab a label place it underneath rename LBL list click OK change the text to nothing so it clears it then open up your blocks editor in the blocks editor we're just going to do a bit of tidying up so move all the functions what we created in the first basic app to the top and minimize the size of them first we're going to do the timeline function so go to the friends chirps when clicked function and then go to request friends timeline in Twitter then go to Twitter and select the when received the timeline add it to the blocks then we're going to define some variables we're going to define three text variables and one number variable this is going to be used to control the list that we receive from Twitter the timeline list and we need to do some list control this might be a good time to go to my website and download the image for the blocks sometimes it's easier to follow go to my blocks my definitions and select list adder set list adder and then add a text box and clear it then grab list index and add one oh need to set that one to one as well then go to blocks control and grab a for loop go to my blocks my definitions and grab timeline and add it to the for loop go back to definitions and select set list user go to the built-in functions to text and select the upper case function go to list and select select list item and then go and select another one and add it to this one the timeline we receive from Twitter is a list within a list 
there's a list of all the friends tweets but then that is made up of the username and their tweet so what we're doing now we're going through each tweet and dividing the two part list into user and the tweet so that's the user done now we're going to get the text from the tweet go to definition get set list chirps do a similar thing to what we did with the user select list item add another select list item go to definitions grab the timeline list the index and because it's the second second item in the list we set that to two what we're going to do for each tweet we're going to add it to our list adder this is going to take all the 20 tweets we received from Twitter from our friends and put it in a massive text ver um, string and then we're going to add it to our list to make it so it's more neat we're going to put line spaces in between the user's name and the tweet and then a double line space between the next tweet this will become more clear when I show you at the end Before we do the final step to this function, inside the for loop we just need to add a little mass function where it increments the list index. It's quite basic. And finally, go to LBL list, set LBL list text to the variable list adder. That's the friends timelines complete. Now we'll move on to the mentions. Go to B T N uh, mentions, and then get the when click function. Then go to Twitter and get the request mentions function add it to the click then go to Twitter and get the when received mentions this does a similar function to the friends timeline as we just done and we're going to do a similar control for this the only thing is that this one is not two lists it's just one list with all the mentions so we're not gonna split the user or we can't split the user and the tweets up so we're just gonna just use the user list to put the whole tweet in So if you just follow to what I'm doing, first we're just going to do the list, select list item, 
I'm going to use the list index to select that item and then we're going to add it to the list adder and then we're going to put that increment function at the bottom and then we're going to add it to the list label and set list label to list adder again and that's the mentions function complete now connect to the emulator and sign in click the friends chirps button And there you go. Got all your friends timeline with the username in capitals and then the tweet underneath. And then you got a line space and then you got the other tweets. Scroll down. I think you get about twenty. I think it is twenty. And go back up. Click mentions. And there you go, got two mentions. Okay, that's it for this tutorial. Hope you found it useful. If you like my tutorials, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Information about this tutorial and others is available on my website, simshelloworld.com. Goodbye.